Yeah, hi, it's the 27th of May 2018 at 1pm. I was talking to my mate Kurt last night and he said, I'm oh, curious, you're a pimp. I said, no, I'm not Kurt. I'm, I'm like, to think of me as a, a, a sort of a new age restaurateur or bar owner. I said, I don't, you know, I don't care what happens to people after they have a date of my online thing. That's their business entirely. I'm not setting it up with prostitution in mind, just as a restaurant doesn't set it up with the idea of, oh, everybody wants, everybody wants a place to come and arrange sex or something. No, they come for a social experience. And, you know, it's, it's, uh, you know, it's the way I'm seeing it is a lot of guys in my, older guys in particular, don't want a full relationship. They don't want to meet people in real but they wouldn't mind a bit of social interaction. You know, maybe they'd meet up, you know, go over a season, meet up with these people or something later. But, but just, just all they really want is, like me, is just a bit of, uh, oh, a bit of female company. Like I like male company, and I spoke, speak mainly to males and men. Uh, but it's, if it's only men, it's too much. Okay, to be honest, it's just it's too much. I like a bit of female company in there, and their madness as well. Um, and look, you know, what am I expecting to get out of all of this? Not much. Uh, in a sense, it's a bit like my little chook deal. You know, I feed the neighbours chooks, they lay eggs, that pays for the feed, plus the pigeons get to eat the free. Now, Neville's getting cheap eggs, and I'm going to get a bottle of whiskey out of it. You know, it's a system that's growing slowly. It, you know, it, it, it's basically paying for my eggs and whiskey, okay? Um, and, and that's mutual benefit. That's how it, you take something and it, it grows. It, it grows in synergy. And so out of this, I'd probably, you know, if with luck, I'll probably end up having, you know, a better relationship with AB. I'll get to, to have meals with occasionally, you know, and, and hopefully the profits will pay for, you know, better equipment her end so I can hear her and see her properly and what have you. You know, and that's it. It's just, it's just a system. Um, it, it's not going to. It's not going to buy a big house or you know expensive holiday somewhere. No, it's just a little system, and it's it's it, it probably suits. Uh, you know, I could I could duplicate the whole site and call it. And you can set up. You know, if anybody's interested, you can set up set up your own. And then it's it's just a. Oh, look, what happens is you, you end up talking to people. Um, you know, on in. Skype and in, in uh, Gmail or what have you, in email, okay, as well as in comments, and it's expanding that way, so it's becoming a broader social experience. Uh, no, it's not prostitution. Yeah, I'll, I suppose you know, you put it to you know the girls and like, you know whatever. It's up to you. That's your business, not mine. But no, what what I do is I, I just you know I set up an invite. I'm trying to sort of find a way to. Um, I don't know, I talk to a lot of guys, and no, no, I have nothing to do with women, no, I don't, just pick out, do it all yourself. To me, it sounds rather greedy and rather, I just don't want to go there, and I've got no interest in it. It's, it's, I like this, I like, I like, um, I like being a part of it. It's hard to describe unless you're a part of it, and unless you do it yourself, you don't understand. But look, just to give you an understanding of it, it it's, it's, because um, I, I laugh with Craig when uh, Kurt said, uh, yeah, you're, you're a pimp. And I thought, no, nah, <laughs> you've got no idea. But just just to give you an example, I was I was talking to a guy last night who was about to have a date with AB. I won't mention his name. And he said, oh, yeah, we've got it all set up. It's all going to happen in, you know, I think he, he paid, you know, $11 or something for whatever it was I was going to have. And she was going to be there in 10 minutes. And I thought, oh, geez, I hope so. Because uh, AB really she just can't get her head around the whole concept of reliability, OK? <laughs> It's not that she's totally untrustworthy. It's just, oh, it's a very free-spirited woman. You know, sort of, oh, I forgot. Or, <laughs> that's right. You, you feel like killing her. But I, I'm, I'm getting to feel like John Cleese and Manuel, you know, out of Faulty Towers, you know, like... <laughs> so anyway, uh, 10 minutes came, half an hour came, an hour came. I thought, all right. Uh, you know, I'm chat, chat, chatting. <laughs> At the same time, in the background, I think, right, you little... Squirrel, what's going to be your excuse? Yeah, the weather, that'll be a classic. Yeah, it's been raining. I couldn't get online, Kiri. Yeah. <laughs> the internet was right. So I looked up the, you know, up the weather. Yeah, Calbiog City, 27 degrees. Yeah, partly cloudy. Yeah, rain expected Sunday, Monday. Yeah, try that one on me, kid. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready for you. You know, I just thought, was, you know, I should have had the little bow tie on, you know, the little moustaches. You know. <laughs> you were supposed to be here. Where were you? Yeah, so anyway... 
And anyway, the guy eventually, you know, it was a late afternoon where he was, so he said, oh, I'll go for a lie down. He said, no drama, you know, which is good of him. And I thought, yeah, you've got to be that way with AB because it's, it's got to be flexible somehow. Yeah, so anyway, she came in and I'm like, where, where were you? <laughs> yeah, the guy's been waiting for you all afternoon. He's already put the money in your account and everything else like that. And I, you know, I, was, I was waiting for the excuse. She, oh, sorry, Kiri, I was at a beach party. You know, like that. Yeah, that's what it would be like. Yeah, there would have been 400 of them down there. All the same family. <laughs> On the beach, you know, laughing and joking. I know I, I had, a, had a date with them the other night. Yeah, all laughing, having a great time. And I thought, yeah, here we are, East meets West. You know, us Westerners are all uptight there. They couldn't give us that. Free as a bird. Yeah, poor as church bells, but free as a bird. And I thought, yeah, that's that's about it, isn't it? So I'm sort of up to I've got all sorts of problems there. Her internet's dreadful. Yeah, I, I don't think she has a phone. Because um, you know, I'm saying to her, yeah, can you just let your date know that you're doing something else? You know, they'll understand if you can tell them. But uh, they, they're just not there, if you know what I mean. It's, it's just, it's all foreign to them. And, you know, and they, they have to learn. But, but AB so far is, I don't know, I think she's sort of learning. It's a slow process, uh, but she's learning and, 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 and retaining the sweetness. So I'm not about to make her uptight. I, I know what our women are like, and they're uptight. And we're uptight. And I think, no. Okay, I'm going to have to try and explain away a few things here, but yeah, no, I'd rather keep that innocent quality, that nice relaxed quality about them. Um, yeah, so, but we're getting there. It, it's happening, happening very slowly, but I don't mind. Um, I'm going to have to spend less time on it in the future and move on, you know, to, to, to other areas. But, but it's, it's, it, it's. I, I like the, the depth that's adding to the channel. And, and while I'm at that, if anybody wants to email me, particularly older guys who have been through the mill, you're probably doing it a bit tough, you may be lonely, you know, it's sort of a, a disillusioned. Um, most of us on the channel have, have had, a lot of us have had that experience. Uh, I'll leave my email address in the description, so feel free to, to, to contact me, just tell me who you are. And um, yeah, and you can sort of just join the, it's sort of like a, a support group um, under the channel, if you know what I mean. It's just guys who have, uh, and some pretty hard stories there, you know, of, of what we've been through. Uh, and there's nowhere else that we can find to go. Um, yeah, so if you'd like to join in, and, and really the, the, the Friendly Club is is adjunct to all of that. It's it's. It's particularly, I, I felt I needed something a couple of years into, you know, after separation and what happened. I didn't want another relationship, but I did want some, some contact with women. And yeah, this, I, I met AB and it was, yeah. Um, yeah, so, I don't know, look, it may, it may suit some of you, um, just occasionally. Just, you know, it's just, yeah, AB actually asked me yesterday if I would put uh, uh, chicken soup and rice on the menu. So she's starting to get a bit more serious about it. She's, in other words, what she's saying is, yeah, I don't really want to drink that much Kiri, but yeah, I wouldn't mind my typical sip, chicken soup and rice, and if I could get paid for that. And that way, you know, it's like she's going to a restaurant, and it costs $6 US for those two things. Um, and, you know, she's, you know, I said, honey, you've got to show up on time and talk to the guy, show an interest in them. And I think we'll get there. I'll get, I'll upgrade her internet. But I think it'll get there in time, and, and when she settles down, because like all things that are new, um, you know, people are a bit silly with them at first. You know, when computers first came out, I, I don't know how many people told me they tried to use the mouse upside down. Um, all that sort of stuff. And, and it, it's, yeah, it's, it's like that. It's, it's just, it, it's all, but when, when it settles down, I think you'll see it's just, yeah, it's just a way to, uh, it's a cheap date. Um, and it's just a way to chat to somebody without any, there's no commitment, you're not going to marry them or anything else like that. It's just a, you know, and then we just meet more people and develop the, the channel, hopefully, you know, as into a support network. So I, I don't really want to, I'm not here to bash women, sorry. If you if you want to do that, you have to go somewhere else. I'm here more as a support, support, to support people who are in my situation and worse. Okay, and try to, to come up with ideas and things to make our lives get, get back to sort of happiness. Anyway, it's been good talking to you, and I'll talk to you again soon.
Let's see ya. Oops, where are we?